Hi guys, it's Queensland here and today I'm going to be showing you how to do a firmware update on your airline MR25. So to be able to do this, you're going to need a Bluetooth dongle to be able to connect your laptop to the quad to be able to actually update it. And you can buy one of these from any hardware store or online, for example, Amazon or eBay. Okay, so the first thing you're going to want to do is go to the Align website. Just open it up here. So when the page is loaded, you want to want to go to download. Scroll down to get to the racing quad and then click on the MR. S flight control. When the page is loaded, scroll down, and here you can see the latest firmware update. Now I'm on Windows, so I'm going to be doing this one. So I'm going to click on that, save wherever you want to save it. I'm going to save this to the desktop. Save. As you see down here, it's downloading. I'll quickly forward the video and I'll be back when the download's nearly done. Okay, so here you are, the download's nearly done. There you go, the download's complete. So you can close that down now. And as you see, we've got a folder here. I'm going to open that up, open this folder up, and then open the other folder up. And as you see, you've got the firmware update sort of file here. And you've got an application here, you need to run this application. First you want to extract it all to your desktop. I'm going to extract this to the desktop so you know where it is. Extract. Once it's extracted, click close then. You can open this folder here. Open the folder again, and then the update one. And as you see you get two exact same folder per uh, applications, the update sort of file and then the application you've got to use. So you want to use that, double click on that, click run and then go through the setup wizard. Accept license and then install. Yes. And I'll be back when that's finished installing. Okay, so as you can see, the update widget has finished installing, so you want to click finish on that. Uh, you can close this down, and now wherever you saved it during the wizard setup, you want to try and find that file. So mine will be saved in computer, go to my hard drive, uh, program files, scroll down to align, MRS update, uh, try and find, and here it is, you want this one right here. So you can double click on that. Okay, so this is what you're going to need to be able to update your quad. So now you want to put your Bluetooth device into your laptop, let it do the driver install, and then once that is done, you can then turn on your quad, uh, and I'll have a little window down in the corner and I'll show you everything I'm doing on that. Okay, so now that your MR25 is connected to your laptop via the Bluetooth dongle, you can now proceed with the firmware update. So you want to have this application open, click on update, it will bring this window up, and you want to find this folder over here that you extracted from this folder earlier. So I know it's on the desktop, you click on the desktop, scroll down, find the folder, here it is, open this folder and open the update folder, then you'll be left with just this application in this folder. This is the firmware update. I'm going to double click on that to open it, and you see it's connected.
and as you can see the format update has begun. The quadcopter will go for a series of sort of things that it does that basically tells you that it is updating. So here we are, the firmware has been updated successfully. Click OK, your MR25 should restart and that is basically it. Hope you've enjoyed this video and I hope it's helped you if you've had any problems trying to do it yourself. Uh, please like the video, share around and I'll be back with more future videos. Thank you very much.